No, but I'm asking you a question. You say human. No, you're not asking what a question. What is the difference you're between a, a human and a human? Yeah. What is the question? You come here, waste what your day. What is the question? I came here to brother. listen to real intellects. So what I've heard is nonsense. <laughs> Sorry, brother. Look, can I yeah, take it? Thank, thank you for your time. Thank you for your time. No, I really okay, can I? No, no, no. Be I asked you. For this it's guy. okay. Don't worry about it. It's normal. I asked you a normal. question. This is Hyde Park. I do not understand you... those people who come here. Well, okay. Like, okay. Okay. Fine. 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 You are the... Listen. Uh, Listen. Uh, I, oh you and I having a discussion. Yes. I asked you a simple question. You have not answered me yet. What? What? Do you believe yes. in the Bible? Um, in the message of the Bible, yes. yes. So I don't believe in the book, it's in the message, which is written. Wait a book. minute, wait a minute. Okay. The Bible is, is, a, is a collection of books. It's not yes. one book. Yes. It's a collection yes. of books. Yes. 66 or 73, whatever. Yes. No, it's so which one, which one do <laughs> don't you... Don't argue, though. Wait a minute. You believe... <laughs> it's a new testament. <laughs> do you believe every word in the Bible is the word of God? Um, that's a tricky question you ask me. No, why? Do, do you, know, you believe do you know in why? the Bible? Do you know why? Why? Because I believe in the message of the Bible. Well, oh, tell God. us the and, message. And wait, wait, no, wait, wait, no, can I, can I answer the question? Wait, okay, no, then my answer for the wait, question wait a minute. is if you, that... I'm if you, a Muslim. If okay. you ask me, if you ask me, yes. do I believe in every word in the Quran yes. from God? Immediately I will say yes. I don't in which have to language? Be, what? In which language? <laughs> Because well, for example, reading, for example, in Swahili, <laughs> okay. in German. Because what I'm trying to in get German, you, in Swahili, uh, sorry, in you don't understand me. Can wait I wait a minute? In any language, in any language, I believe that every word in the Quran yes. is the word from God. In your okay, Bible, okay. do you believe the same thing? Yes, yes or no? In, yes, yes. In, the okay. in the message, in the context of the message. <laughs> okay. And the yeah, point brother, you don't understand... Brother, maybe you can ask him to make this distinction that he keeps making. It, oh, that's between, a good question. Make the <laughs> distinction. That's a good question. What, a literal what is the word message and, and the what's message? the word? The, word. The, yeah. the problem with this is if you translate mm -hmm. something, you can make mistakes in the word. Mm -hmm. But the message is the same. Mm -hmm. Oh, so you've point. made a mistake. Right, okay, brother. So if we say that if it's translated, it can possibly cause confusion, which I can accept. Yeah. Can we... Not the confusion if you have the same message. Yeah. I mean, yeah, okay, with translations, yeah. yeah. But if we were to rephrase the question and say, okay, I'm sorry, what is your name, brother? Lucas. Sorry. Lucas, I'm Shabir. Shabir. Yeah, Shabir. nice meeting you, yes. I know one Shabir Ali. You do? Yeah, he's my relative in Canada. Yeah. Yeah, yeah through Adam. From, yes, yeah. I know him. Okay. But if we are to take that same question and say, okay, let's look at the original language that it was yes. written in. Yes. Do you accept that to be the literal word of God? Yes. Right, carry on. Okay. Yes. What that, language was it written in originally? That's why we're asking why you know. What Arabic. language was it written in originally? The Bible. <laughs> Which part? Hebrew? Any of them. The Bible. The Bible. The Bible. The book. Bible was not in one language. Uh -huh. What language was it written in? The Old Testament was written in Hebrew, right? Uh -huh. yeah. And the New Testament? In Greek. You know this, right? In Greek. Yes. And Jesus spoke Greek. No. <laughs> so, he did it. Okay, wait a minute. I will ask. You, wait, wait, wait a minute. I'll ask you a question. Who has no beginning, no end, never born, never died? Who's that? I don't know. You tell me. <laughs> I don't know. Look, you be, you wait, 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 don't wait know. a minute. Wait a minute. Who has, who has no beginning, no end? No mother, no father. You're talking and about God or are you talking about something else? I'm asking you, who do you understand that to be? Can you make a simple question? This is not a play game or something. No, you know, you play a game. game when I was a child. Come wait, on, wait man. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. As, you know, we, we be know, a man. We know. <laughs> <laughs> we know we know God okay. has no beginning, no end, no Infinite, mother, no yes. father. Right? Have no mother, no father. Oh, yes, yes, yes. God has yes. no mother, no yes. father, no beginning, yes. no end. Yes. No genealogy. Yes. And you've read your Bible. Yes. <laughs> okay. What's so tell me, when I read the Bible yes. and I come across Hebrews 7, where it says, This yes. Melchizedek, son of Sa uh, King of Salem, yes. without mother, yes. without father, yes. without beginning, without end, without genealogy, who's that? King, which was the king too? Yes. Yes. You read the Bible? Yes. 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 Yes
nothing. He had no mother, no father. He was never born. Oh, he was a Yes. He was a person. He was a human being. He was a That's not what the Bible says. Are you reading properly, man? Jesus is on the likeness of that priest. So yeah. his priesthood will last forever. But the priesthood of Melchizedek didn't mother. last forever. But yeah. so who is greater? So Melchizedek or, go, or Jesus? Or Jesus. No, yes. he had a mother. But Jesus had a mother. This guy had no mother and no, no father. You, you, you misunder you misleading, you misunderstand you, are you saying you don't understand properly the context I'm of, stupid. No 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 no, you're not stupid. <laughs> Your Bible is saying that he had no mother and no father. What are you, what are you doing? And if the Bible is from God, no, this is then you're telling Bible me God doesn't, doesn't know everything. That. The yeah. Bible doesn't teach that. You're taking a sentence, cutting off from the entire context. Salam alaikum, Are you okay? It's not like that. You have to read the Bible properly. Can I just stop? Sorry. You see, you see the, the verse itself, Melchizedek. Yes. High priest. Yes. He met Abraham. Yes. Was he a person? Who? Melchizedek. Yes, he was a priest. Yeah. <laughs> was he a person? Was he a human? Was he a, was he a human person? Being. Yeah. Yes. Was he? Okay. If he was a person, do you know of any person who doesn't have a father, who doesn't have a mother? 
No, you, you don't get the context. No, no, I'm asking. Oh, we'll go to the context. the context. I will, I will go with you with the context. But the first question is, do you know of any person? We've established Melchizedek was a person. Do you know of any person who doesn't have a mother, no, who doesn't I, have I, a I again. No, no, can you just listen to my yes. question, brother? Do you know of any person, and this person has been established to be yeah, a... Yeah, there is no person without mother he, or father. Yeah. This, no, this person, Melchizedek, has yeah. been established to be a person who has also met Abraham. Abraham gave him some of his spoils of war. Yeah. According to, so he was a person, okay, like me and you. Yeah. Okay, good. If he was a person, tell me of one name in history yeah. where there is a person who, according to the description, says no father, no mother, no beginning, no, no end, ending, no genealogy. No genealogy. Name me one person. No. Okay, let's take there let's take one. Jesus. Let's take Jesus according to the verse, yeah. because it says according to the word you use, the likeness. Yeah, you yeah. use the word likeness. The priesthood. Right? Okay, let's yeah. let's do it. Not, not the person. Or, I didn't ask about the priesthood. I asked about the person. We're asking about the so I'm asking you about the person. Yeah. Again, I will ask. Yeah. Do you know of any person like that? Without a mother. No father, father, no mother, no beginning, no end, no genealogy. That's the son of God. <laughs> Shall we make a like for like comparison yes. according to that? But okay, let's let's take this. Person. Je the son of God, the person. Yes. Okay. Yes. Melchizedek the person. Yes. Yes? yes. Melchizedek the person. Father? Yes. No. No father. Mother? I, I don't know. We have to check in the Old Testament. What is the Old Testament? We don't well, believe. here is a problem. You see, I agree with you. No, I have to check. No, no, no. I agree with you. If I can just finish, brother. Yeah? You see? Yes. You are reliant on the message of the Bible from yes. what I heard your conversation. Yes. Yes. But that message is enshrined in the words of the Bible. Correct? Yes. Are you following that? Yeah, again. The message that you yeah. believe in, yeah, is, in, the Bible. Yeah, is in enshrined yeah, in the yeah, Bible. Yeah. The words of the Bible, if they are not interpreted properly, yes. can lead you to a misunderstanding. Yes. If certain words are employed in the Bible, yes. like for example, person, yeah? You know, a few minutes ago, when they were all talking at the same time, you said to them, yes. I can't hear three persons at the same time. Exactly. Yes. But you can believe in three persons being one. I don't believe three persons okay. being one person. They are separate, aren't they? Yes. Three persons, Father, Son and Holy Ghost. Yes. Three persons separate. Yes. Not all one. Again, no. you confuse no. me. No, exactly. Confused, no. no, no, it's not confused. I'm yeah. telling you, you see how words are causing a bit of... No, so, you're, you're confused with the logical stuff. Oh, no, we'll get to that. You're saying three persons can be one person. Of course they no, no. can't be no, one person. No, no, they can't be one person. It's impossible, so, isn't it? In what they are one? No, no, it's impossible, isn't it? But if we just follow this... and Can, we'll, can we leave five, two minutes? Because of a call. <laughs> oh, sorry, of course. Please. Hello? You know what I was leading yes. up to, but they wouldn't let me finish. Yes. See, Jesus, you know what he said. Yes. Look, Absolutely. I'm alive. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yes, because when he, was, when he was talking about prophecy, <laughs> yeah. you know what I mean? Yes. That's the only one. They got 3,000 prophecies. <laughs> that's the one. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, is this uh, Swiss? Yeah, I have no idea. 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 No it's very hard to get by that. Sorry. It's okay, brother. It's okay. Yeah, so going back to what we are saying. You see, when you are looking at the words, yeah. that message that you believe in is yeah. in the Bible. Yeah. So now the question is, when we look at the two persons, yes. Yes, yes. we are finding this. Melchizedek, father, no father. Mother, yes. no well, mother. You have to, again, you have beginning, to, no, no beginning. Ending, what are you doing? What are let you me doing finish. Now? Let me finish. Beginning, no beginning. Ending, no ending. That's Melchizedek. No, okay? that's the point. You don't get it. No, the person. No, that's the point. You don't get it. Okay. Why you don't get it? Explain. Is yeah. That in the Old Testament, if you read it, you can find out over there that he's just a human being. Who was? Melchizedek. Okay. Yes, he was. So if he was so a human don't leave the New Testament. Leave it. We're not talking about Go to about the, the Old New Testament. Testament. Check the Melchizedek. Okay. Check what the Bible says what about Melchizedek. What do you know Melchizedek. about Melchizedek? Now, what is the point of the letter to the Hebrews right, about brother, the Melchizedek? Brother, you are, yes. if I can just follow your reasoning. Okay. You have said, let's look at the Old Testament. Yes. So, you have obviously understood 
the Bible to be able to establish that the message is for you. Correct? Oh, yes. Okay. Now, what does the Old Testament say about Melchizedek, which is different from me and you accepting that he was a human being and a person? Well, we have to check what actually says. What do you him. think it says? I, what, what I remember, actually, yes. because I didn't read a long time about Melchizedek. Okay. But as far as I remember, he was a priest. Yeah, and we had, know. We've established that from yes. the New Testament. And he was he a priest some kind of, of the he, Most High God. Yes, he had a... Um, no, no, no. He, the Melchizedek, yeah. had a specific, um, unique role as a priest. Stop there, brother. Good, Stop there. Yeah. When you say he had a unique role, Okay, that is to do with his. It was the highest priest. It, it was to do with his. It was yes. It was to do with his priesthood. I think he was. What we are talking about is not his priesthood. No. We are talking about his person. And that's yeah. the point. So, you question. Don't understand from the no, no, that's fine. But now yeah. I'm asking you. Okay. If I don't understand, tell yes. me. What does the Old Testament say? Was he a person or was he not? Of course he was. Of course he was. Was he a he was Jewish priest? Right. Yeah. No, no, no. A priest <laughs> is the role. Was he a person? Just like God is God, and there is a person. What was the role of this? You are talking about he the role of a human I'm... being. Ah, excellent. Ah, excellent. Right. Was he a human I was being? This. <laughs> One second. Was he a human being? Yes. Melchizedek. Yes. Of course he was. Was human. he a person? He was, was he a person? A human being. Okay, I'm person. asking you again. Yes. Was he a person, yes. brother? Yes? Sorry, but he's yes. No, right. yes? No, I'll tell you why. Yes, You'll okay. make the distinction. Was he a person? Of course he was. Yes, he was. Was Jesus Christ a human being? He became a human being. I mean, Jesus Christ is the human being, yes. Oh, he was, a, was he a person? Yes. He was. Okay, so now when it says... What, now, uh, what, now when what it, person he was? Son. We'll, go, we'll get to that, okay. but let's just follow this train of thought. Okay. Now, Melchizedek, <laughs> priest. Yes. yes. What was Jesus? High, the highest priest. Was he a priest? Highest priest. Was yes. Jesus a priest? Yes. Okay. In the Melchizedek, Melchizedek, was he a person? Yes, but I yes, he was. point. You Let me get to it. Jesus was a person. Yes. Melchizedek, no father. Jesus, no father, the person. Melchizedek, no mother. Jesus, mother. Melchizedek, no beginning. Jesus, beginning, according to the person, human being. If you check the Old now, Testament. I'm again, asking you. We, we're if you check the we're Old Testament. Testament. I, if you well, check the Old Testament. The Old Testament. You will say that he was just human being. He had I a agree. mother, father, and he died. Now he has a problem then. And the problem if, is that you don't understand the context and the message of letter to Hebrews about Melchizedek and Jesus. Right, excellent. Let's follow that through. So you are saying the Bible in the Old Testament says he had a father and he had a mother. Who? Oh. Melchizedek. Yes. Show me where. I don't know if it's written or it's not written. Right, wait a minute. If you don't know whether it's written or not, how do you know it is there? Because he was a human being. I agree with you. For Christ's sake, I agree. But even Christ was a human being, brother. But here's the problem. You see, it's not it, complicated to understand. He was Jewish I'm priest. sorry, I've forgotten your name, brother. Lucas. Lucas. He was no, no, no. Uh, uh, in Lucas. the community. I know. He was human. That means he this is going to sound this is going to sound a bit funny, but you are only giving me what you want to believe. I'm not asking you for that. You believe that See, you Lucas, if I can like just finish. Water? All I'm saying to you is if you look at the evidence, because the evidence, the evidence may be giving you a different picture. That's what I'm addressing. So, for example, yes. and I was just following the yes. train of thought. You see, Melchizedek, according to that statement, is saying without father, without mother, without beginning, without end. You are insisting that the Old Testament says he was born a human being, so he had a mother and a father. I am saying to you, Lucas, wait. For you to understand the true role of Hebrews and what the message was about Melchizedek, you need to show me the evidence in the Old Testament which says yes. to me, the well, is, can yeah, I just yeah, finish? Yeah. Which says to me he had a mother, he had a father, he had a beginning and he had an end. Can you do that? The problem is that yes. you you putting something to the context no, he hasn't. and you're trying to do it. No, he hasn't put anything One second, brother. Let, let, let him, let him say. You. Right, you brother Lucas, to sorry to interject. Okay. Uh, yes. If you listen carefully, I'm only asking you a question for evidence. Yes. I'm not interpreting anything. So the evidence if is, I can just yes. finish, it is only when the evidence is produced we will assess it. Yes. So right now I'm asking you, yes. where is the evidence in the Old Testament according to your words? Where is the evidence in the Old Testament that says to me yes. definitively Melchizedek had a father, had a mother, he had a beginning, he had an end? Have you got the that evidence? Is here that no, it's you, a simple question, brother. Have you got question, the evidence? The simple, simple question. Please. The yeah, question sure. Is that he was human being. Now. Do you understand? Now, okay, watch is. this, watch this. So I'll, I'll follow you, your reasoning, you, brother. You can't. No problem. 
You look, can't say, I mean, if okay, you, let's you can't do like this. You, you're making a logic. You're making a logic. Show me a, a verse in the Bible that Mahalizah has a father. I will I, not show you. Oh, therefore, he's not had a father. No, 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 no. This is not the no, logic No, no, it follow. isn't. It isn't, brother. He has, he's hmm? a human being, yeah. right? Yeah. He's a Jewish priest. Yes. And he was serving like everybody else in those yeah. times. Yeah. That means, in a logical sense, yes. he has a father, okay. has a mother. It yeah. doesn't show exactly. Maybe I, I didn't check this. Maybe it's there. I, I don't remember well, about the Mechizedek. Well, 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 yes. Right, so, okay. Lucas. So, in the context of the Old Testament, yeah. no, leave the New Testament. Leave it. Okay, leave it. You have the Old Testament. Yeah. You read the Old Testament. Yeah. If you read the Old Testament, what conclusion will you follow okay. from the reading the, about the Melchizedek in right. the Old Testament? Okay. Will you come to the conclusion that he did have the mother and the father? Yeah. Will okay. you? Watch this. No. Will I'll, you or not? I'll, will you or not? Okay, I'll will respond. You or not? I'll respond. According, Old Testament, no New I'll, Testament. I'll respond. Then. According to the New Testament, yes. if it doesn't specifically tell me he had a mother and a father, yes. and beginning and ending, yes. and I read only the Old Testament, I would probably come to the conclusion it's only talking about a normal human being. Yes. And a normal human being obviously yes. has a mother and a father, exactly. and a beginning and an end. That's but then, got the now, now one, yes. uh, one second. Yes. Now then it causes an even bigger problem for me. Because if I am now convinced that he had a mother, he had a father, he had a beginning and he had an end, I went to the New Testament and the New Testament now tells me no beginning, no, no end. Uh, yes, I understand your no. point. I, let me finish, let me finish. But I understand your point. No, I haven't got you, it to it yet. The point is no. that she has had the mother and the father and little let end. Let finish. Let yeah. finish. <laughs> no mother, no father, no. But then the greater problem is this now, which you are going to have to agree with. You see, if we take him according to the information as a normal human being, Yes, then I would suggest to you that if you take the yes. whole of the Bible, you yes. will find Jesus to be a normal human being. Yes. Complete. Yes. Nothing to do with a difference in persons. No, the point is what you get. Uh, did you just hear what I said? Yes. What did he, I say? He is the human being. No, I didn't say that. What did I say after that? About the persons. Yes. Is he different, the person? Hmm? Is he different? Who is different person? Jesus. Jesus. Or Melchizedek? Jesus. But Jesus is not Melchizedek. Uh, no, no. <laughs> right. I, I will slow down. Yeah, I'm saying if Melchizedek, I don't know, no, I understand. What Lucas. is your logic? What is your logic? You're trying to prove this I, is Melchizedek? No, what? no, no. I think no. you missed the boat. No. The logic here is this, that if yes. the Bible is telling you something, yes. yes, and you have built your message on the words of the Bible, the pro, the, if I, I can just I finish, Lucas. Now, okay, no, what I'm now to I am you. saying what to I'm you, to no, you. no, no, I'm, let me yes. just finish, brother. I'm saying to you, if it seems like you are yes. not familiar with certain aspects yes. of uh, words that seem to be very important when taken yes. in context yes. Yes. how have context. you uh, how have you concluded that the message that you have derived from it is entirely correct you see right now you've got access here i i would i would say to you so to, if yes. i can just i would say to you okay i tell you what you do lucas so the, just type okay, the context, if i can just finish I'm getting, if i can just finish talking all the time <laughs> not at all i waited for you i waited here for 20 minutes listening to you really? but Thank here you. yeah <laughs> If you put in Google Melchizedek in the Old Testament, yeah. it will give you the evidence. Can we look at that? So what I'm trying to get to you, the point Google. is that... No, no, Lucas, can we look at the you, evidence? Why don't you do it? Because I don't have to. Why? Okay. Well, we are. You can carry on? Yeah, do it. Yeah, your pleasure but meeting you, Lucas. What he says, you can say he's a liar or he's telling the truth. Or, or I can say, okay, let's assess let's the evidence yeah. now. We want the evidence. So what I'm trying to get to you, the point is that the let in, the, in this letter, Lucas, this, with respect, brother, uh, I asked you look, for listen, a simple look, thing. I just can we find the evidence? Listen, listen. Because you are trying to. How can I? I'll tell you why, brother. Respectfully, respectfully, I only asked you a question to do one thing. Yes. Just pull up on Google Melchizedek in the Old Testament. What I'm trying to get you the point. No, no. Will you just do what I said? No. 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 Okay. Because you don't because want that's to. Fine. to. <laughs> that's fine. I yeah, understand. No, I appreciate that. Don't yeah. worry. You can carry on, Uncle. Yeah. Pleasure meeting Listen, you, Lucas. You didn't even give me an answer. No, because because I, I, I wasn't like. asking. I wasn't. Simple, I was just said. simply look asking you to look, look for evidence. evidence. But the simple is not to find the context in the well, whole letter. Well, if you the, don't. the context of the whole letter of the Hebrews. It's not to prove that Melchizedek was without the mother or father. That's not what we are trying to do, Lucas. What we are trying to You're make trying you to understand. No, respectfully, what okay. we are trying to make you understand yes. is how you have totally misunderstood. 
That's all we are trying to make you understand. So when I am taking your logic so, through, so if, I can, finish, if I can just finish, if I can just finish, the logic, and without and no, the logic, get it. I'll tell you why you don't get well, it. You see, you, you know when you are reading something, brother, yes? What is the point? Give me the point yeah, you're trying I'm, to I'm tell trying me. To, I'm trying to give you. Give the idea. What is the idea? I'm, I'm trying to, it's not okay. an idea, I'm trying to tell you. Okay. You know, when you are reading something, once you have read a sentence or a paragraph or a chapter, yes. you derive an understanding from it. If the message, you, yes. Whatever it is. If you read a passage or a yes. paragraph that says, no father, no mother, no beginning, no end, no genealogy, these are words yes. which impart a particular In which context. If I can finish, said. if I can finish. Because you're doing the mistake now. I'm not. You ask me, can I finish? Because I already see the now, mistake you're doing. Well, let me finish and you. And you don't want to show me this. No, no. Why? Why? I tell you, Lucas, <laughs> if you allow me to finish. Okay. okay. So you said I made a mistake. And how did I make the mistake? You told me. You missed the content. Wait, wait, wait. You told me, no, you made a mistake because what you do, leave the old, te the New Testament on the side and let's go to the Old Testament and see what it says about Melchizedek. So I said to you, okay, no problem, Lucas. Let's go to the Old te Testament and show me what it says about his father, his mother, his beginning, his end. Because if we read the Old Testament on its own, we will appreciate and understand that it's only talking about a human being. I said, well, then that causes an big, even bigger problem because if you go to the New Testament and the New Testament talks about Melchizedek having no beginning, no end, no father, no mother, no genealogy, then it... See, if I can, you, you keep talking all the time the no, same thing. Yeah, I do no, understand because what you're trying to say. I, I don't think you, don't you understand, understand at all. No, all I am saying to you is I this. I do understand Okay, you. so can we look at the evidence? Me, you're trying to tell me... Can we look at the evidence? Melchizedek was without mother in the no, New Testament. No, I'm not trying to tell you. I'm and telling you, look. And then the I'm, 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 I'm trying blah, to blah, tell blah, you, Lucas, no. I'm trying to tell you, if the New Testament says something completely different... I to what, do understand you now. Can I you just think finish? it's a contradiction. No. If, the, <laughs> if you allow me to finish, you'll come to it. If the New Testament is telling yeah. you something completely different so, to what... what no, no, no. Let me finish. Thank <laughs> you, brother. Get, get yeah? <laughs> if, <laughs> if, yeah? If the New Testament says something completely contrary to what you thought the Old Testament said, then logic dictates that you must now go to the Old Testament and seek out that evidence. All I'm saying to you is, okay, please give me that evidence. Okay. Can you give me that evidence? So it's about being without mother and father. Yes. Well, here and here is, doesn't say anything, right? No, here. I'm asking, does it say anything? Okay, this again, my point is. Go ahead. Answer the question is, go ahead. First of all, the Old Testament. Yeah. We, if you read the Old Testament and you've never heard about New Testament, you come to the conclusion he's just a human being and blah 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 blah. We accept? Accept. That's done. No, it isn't. Now, no, 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 wait, no, wait, wait, wait. That's done. Old Testament is done, right? No, no. Specific. And now you're coming to the New Testament. Okay, let's go. Let's, right? Let's forward. Yeah? Yeah, okay. And then you read something like this. Okay. But the, pur the, the purpose of all of this, you have to read the entire context, what the author, the author, sorry, was trying to tell you. Oh, can I respond? Your opinion. Okay, he's no, no. He's, no. He's, he can I respond? To tell you something. I agree he was with you. Using like whole length to I explain agree. you something. I agree with he was you. Not but brother, us that I, he's no, no, no. I, of father, I, yeah, he was doing I, something I, else. I agree with you. Bigger context in this. Are you finished, brother? Are you finished? Is, if the perfect could have been attained through the Levitical priesthood, and indeed the law given to the people established the priesthood, why was there still need for another priest to come? One in the order of Melchizedek, not in the order of Aaron. For when the priesthood is changed, the law must be changed also. Yeah. He of so, See the context. What is trying, he trying to, get to, say? to you? Okay, is stop there, Lucas. I'm going to ask you. you know? Right. Tell me what was the priesthood? What was the? You, you, no, no, what no, Lucas. I'm trying to tell you. You grab a verse from the Bible without the mother, without Lucas, the Lucas, brother. Then you see the Old Testament. Mm. Melchizedek, the human being. Right. You see the contradiction okay. like this? No, no, I no, never saw any contradiction. I what I'm trying it. to get to you, again, again, read the entire chapter. Yeah. See the point of Paul who's talking about the letter. <laughs> what is the main message of this? Yeah. Find this message, then apply the rest, mm. what he's trying to teach about Melchizedek. Appreciate yeah? it, yes. And that's Appreci all. You, you see, Lucas, brother, I, I agree yeah. with you, but you see, the problem here is yeah. I'm trying, okay. trying to deal with facts. 
you, well, the fact if I can just finish, you, if yeah. I can finish, brother, now. I'm trying to deal with facts, and those facts ought to be derived from the evidence. You are talking from what you want to believe. Now, let me finish, let me finish, finish brother, you. let me finish, let me finish. The now, context. brother, can I? You see, Lucas, the yes. problem here is this. Yes. You yourself are merely reading the context now and trying to derive an understanding. And let me tell you how. You see, if I ask you right now, what was the priesthood of Aaron? Aaron? Yes, what was it? The priesthood of Aaron? Yeah, what Aaron was it? It was exactly the same as Sorry, the what was people, that? Yeah? Did you say probably it was like exactly yeah. the same? Yeah. Do you know definitively what it was? Listen, I don't know Bible Lucas. by heart. Lucas, uh aha, -huh. okay. Now no, I do, I we, will not you see, suddenly tell you, like, you know. Agreed, but Lucas, that's so, not the point. So, the point here is... There is a message which, can I for just, example, yeah. we get something. You and, see, and, Lucas, and I agree. I don't expect you to. But now the problem is you are making a damning admission on yourself. Because you are not... If I can just finish, brother. You're just making me fool like that. No, no, no. I wouldn't make you want to look like a fool. No, brother. Not a fool. No, no. If I can just finish. You see, you are making a damning admission for yourself. Very simple. I ask a question, for example, like this. I know we will not answer this, and then I'm attacking you on this. No, 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 not at all. I, I wouldn't do that. I wouldn't you do that. <laughs> no, no. That's your opinion, <laughs> which you are entitled to. But you see, brother, I'm asking, when you are reading something and you are trying to make me understand the context, which is acceptable, well, brother, yourself. one second, yeah. uh, which is acceptable, the problem arises that when you are understanding the context, you are actually also making the admission that some of the things that you have just read you don't really understand and now if you don't really understand them and you have also admitted you haven't read the whole of the bible how in the world have you come to the conclusion that your opinion is correct okay again did you understand what i said i did but what i'm trying to get to you again you trying to you have to read entire letter and make the, okay. find the context, okay? You, you don't just grab I agree, stuff. brother. I'm not yeah. disagreeing. But yeah. what I'm saying to you, Lucas, yeah. is this, brother. You okay. see, you read the context. And now, if I ask you, and I did what say I'm with evidence, to... if I can just finish. With evidence, you must learn how to assess it. Now, I know now, that. Yeah, That's well, I, I'm, I'm, I'm you. glad you do. The now, I'm saying to you. In the Old Testament, he's a human being like mm. everybody else. He's yeah. Jewish. He's a priest. Okay. And then you will never came to the conclusion yeah. that he's without the mother yeah. and all you've misunderstood this, this but yeah. anyway leave that but you but Let, the point is why maybe i'm really misunderstood you are misunderstanding you are always brother. keeping this you are, no no all no. the time we don't matter check it that's, that's what it said <laughs> that, yeah. yeah i tell you what we'll do yes. yeah we'll leave that one brother we'll leave that one basically yeah. the point is this do you know so for example can i ask you the question if you read that no. chapter one what is the context and the, t the clear message look what the paul is trying to tell here is what i'm about trying the mechanism so here is what do you know it? Uh, let me tell you do you know it? You s are you asking now can yes, i respond yes. okay i am telling you yes. that for me to understand the context yes. for me to understand the context yes, yes. i would need to know what it says in the old testament yes agreed yes. okay so now i'm asking you a simple question what does it say about Melchizedek in the Old Testament and his birth, his death, his... Oh, you see, again, you see, you're talking now, about birth you see, and this and... Brother... It's not about the birth and this, you're talking about no, no. his priesthood. Ah, let's stop there, let's stop. Let's and go to the priesthood. And he's comparing the priesthood of, of Melchizedek to and the priesthood of the Son of God. Okay, excellent. Jesus. What was and the... That is the main context of this. Brilliant. And you're talking about Agreed. without mud and without... This. Agreed. This is not the context Agreed. of it. Agreed. So what was the priesthood the of Melchizedek? The is trying to tell us that the Melchizedek has no mother. Brother, what was the priesthood yes. of Melchizedek? You have to understand this. I'm asking. Sorry. What was the priesthood of Melchizedek? He, uh, as far as I remember, he was the What do you mean, priest. as far as you remember? Yes, that means so exactly what I said. So what exactly? <laughs> what does the evidence we say? Have to go to and check it, yeah? Now, I'm number one. Yes. The priesthood of Aaron, what was it? Again, I'm trying Again, to Again, we have to check. Now, this is... No, no, not time. at all. You, you see, you've created those remember, circles yourself no, respectfully, brother. As far as I remember, and he was the highest priest. Yeah. There was only one person, as far as I remember, on my knowledge, is yeah. the only one person in the Jewish Not a problem, brother. Time, Excellent. The priest, okay. Yeah? Here is so what now, I would suggest now, to you in closing, brother. I'm trying to give you the message. Brother. The message of this yeah. is, yes, if perfection could be have been attained through the Levitical priesthood, yes. that's the priesthood you're talking about, right? No. What is the priesthood of Mechizedek? No, that's you, the priesthood uh, of Levitical, yeah? I don't they think you just... <laughs> and indeed, the law given to the people established that priesthood. Why was there still need for another priest to come on in the order of Melchizedek, not in the order of Aaron? Yes. And then he's trying to explain us, yes, that there is a need for a priest. 
yes. what was the yeah. reason see, for the priest of yeah. high priest? He yeah. was doing the atonement for sins. In yes, the, yeah? absolutely. In, like Melchizedek, in, in Aaron, and no. all of the priests. Yes, you and he needed that's one that's final priest. Okay. And now we have the final priest right. who will build this one Brilliant. for all. And no. there will no need to be another priest yeah. to do uh, like sacrificial of uh, okay. animals, right. what they yes. did. Yes. And Jesus, son of God, did it. And this is the main main context of the entire Okay, chapter. excellent. Yes. Now I will follow your reasoning and come to one conclusion only. That the priesthood that you talk about, the question that Paul alleged... Such a high priest truly meets our need. One who is holy, blameless, pure, set apart from sinners, exalted above the heavens, Unlike the other high priest like Melchizedek. Excellent. Now, can I ask you a question? He does not need to offer sacrifices day after day. First, for his own sins, yeah. and then for the sins of the people. Yeah, he sacrificed for the sins once for all when he offered himself. That's the, oh, sorry. That's the main key of the now, now context. You, brother, that the Melchizedek was doing the yeah. highest priest. Accepted. He was like everybody human yeah. being. He has to offer for his own sins and yeah. sins of the people. Okay. Now we have the, and he's comparing, like in the order of Melchizedek, yes. now we have the perfect high priest yeah. who did it once and for all perfectly. It's okay. done and it's finished. Yeah, now, no need for the priest. Now, you see, brother, yeah. no problem. Your belief you are entitled to. No, but I just the, read it. Uh, yeah, but the evidence is speak a bit no, different. I just read it. Right. <laughs> if you have just read it, yes. when this brother asked you, yes. Yes, when sir. this brother asked you whether you believed every word of the Bible, what had you said? Again, you're trying to catch in my word. Oh, I'm not yeah. trying to catch you, brother. I'm yes, just asking, did. what did you, you say did. to him? What did I reply? You said it. What did you say what to I him? What I answered. What did you say? What I answered. Brother, you are the one who spoke. What did you say? Well, I already answered. So, do you remember that? Yes. Yes, I do. But what did you say? So, what? I said. Yeah. I will say the it again, message. okay? Yes. The most important is the message. Because if you translate words, right? The translation, for example, if you translate from Hebrew to the English, you might find a different words, but the message is exactly the same. So the, the words is very important. They are the most important in the original language. Right, excellent. But if you translate, now, the key is the message. That's now, why we use no the problem. words to, to say the message, right? Now, that's what you said, didn't We you? can see, um, we have one message, for example, and we can express this with different words. Okay. Are you so right? Word, no, brother. You see, the word. here, like here that. is the problem. Yeah. <laughs> Absolutely. But you had to read the words to, to get the message. Yeah. To get the message. Yeah. And I said to you, and this is a simple thing. Yeah. And the, it's quite logical. If you are going to, for example, you said the mathematical probability yeah. one times 10 to the power 50 on a mathematical footing one times 10 to the power 50 and anything beyond is considered a mathematical impossibility okay now yeah now i ask you this okay you referred to some study that was made yes by your professors not mine I, no no I by have... university professors yes. Yes. have you got that evidence yes where is it we can check it online i can give you just the... check it I'm Show not me. sure if I have with me actually. Just, just say uh, one times ten uh, probability of three hundred prophets is coming I can through. Give even a YouTube link if you want. No, no, just the professor. You see, yeah. the yeah, the evidence, yes, so the evidence. that we can yes, assess evidence. it. Yes. Now I ask you this: if the pro three hundred prophets yeah, is that's what I'm saying. You want evidence? I can give. No, you no, no. Yeah? please, please, okay. please. Okay. But you want the YouTube link about it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can forward me the link. Have I got a card? There you are, brother. You, you can forward you me the link. Oh, you can. Yeah. You want to... Have you got a pen, brother? Yeah. You don't mind. I'm handless. <laughs> You never did tell us what the message is. We know. So if you can just give us the link, brother. Well, it's slow. <laughs> hmm? Slow. Okay, there we go. Well, I'm getting there. <laughs> it's all right. Don't worry. Takes time. I'm getting there. I know. Yeah. It's a long, a long. Sorry. Long. Sorry. <laughs> 
Many people now. <laughs> Okay, there we go. If you type in YouTube, proof of God, proof of God, the real report is that, that Jesus fulfilled. fulfilled. Yeah, just put that. So, this is this is not like um, everybody proof can of, do YouTube stuff. Proof this of is, what? Let me see. How are you? Thank you. Okay. Likewise, everything okay? Good, good, good. Yeah, just a few, a few minutes, brother. YUBRO at hotmail.co.uk. Of course I can. BRO at hotmail.co.uk. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Hi from. <laughs> Okay, I'll try to send the link. Yeah, yeah, just send it, no problem. That's fine. Uh, videos. No, it's different. Mm. Right, so it's different. I have to go to the YouTube and then I think you can send. Yes, okay. Okay. Right, okay. if you say so. Yes. <laughs> Again, what was that? Why you BRO? Okay, you uh -huh. at hotmail.co.uk. Okay, yeah. Again, at hotmail.co.uk, yeah. Yeah? Got it. Dot co dot uk? Yes. You will have hotmail. No, uh, yes, no, it's oh, dot co sorry. dot uk. Oh, oh shit, sorry, <laughs> delete that. <laughs> How you just go back up there yeah, and how clear it. Again. Go right back again. <laughs> yeah, because I pressed it by mistake. Okay, there we go. Gmail. You, bro. There we go. At hotmail. Dot co. See you again. Yeah, dot uk. Okay, okay. Yeah, you got it? Yeah, I got it. Excellent, good. I Send just that. To yeah. Give you my name. Yeah, sure, please. By mistake, I just simply <laughs> press delete instead of enter. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh it's okay. Send. Oh, yeah. Send Excellent. Here's my card, brother. He's done. Yeah. You, you, we have got a YouTube channel. Okay. Okay. Here. I will have a read of this. I will have a look at that. And then hopefully we can communicate on email. Oh, really? I, are you here all the time? Uh, I would like to. <laughs> yeah, I know. What? Do you come once every... Um, it all depends, to be honest. Is it? it well, what we'll do over the email, we'll communicate. Because we come here once every four or five weeks. 
Yeah. yeah. So we will see. Yeah, we'll see how we are going along. Yeah. Hopefully, no, no, a month, every month. Every week. month. Yeah. Every month, yeah. once a week. Once a month, we once come. Once a month. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So hopefully, I'll have a look at that, and then hopefully we can converse. That's Pleasure good. meeting you, brother. Let the God of Abraham, Jacob, and Isaac yes. bless you. Yes. Likewise. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. Okay. Yes. Look after yourself. <laughs>